Now in home design, we're joined by Hamish, and you've brought along an expert to help us out, Hamish. I have. We're heading into the cooler months, uh, and so it's time to get ready for that. So meet Jeff Peck from Pex Plumbing Plus. Good to see you again, Jeff. Hi, he's, Mike. He's going to have a chat to us all about fireplaces. Nice. Okay, so what are the benefits of having a fireplace? Um, aesthetics are always one. You know, adds a design element to, to the room, uh, ambience and things like that. Uh, value, it's a good asset to have in a house for resale or um, just for use, general use, and, and also um, uh, the ambient side of things, using adding character to the room, uh, an event and things like yeah, that. Yeah, there's something quite romantic about a fireplace as well, quite cosy that everybody loves. So what sort of fireplaces, what different types have we got? Uh, you've got the traditional wood fireplace, of course, uh, gas, pallet fires, um, and electric as well. Okay, and what about when it comes to, you know, just choosing the room? Hey, we should be able yeah. to help with well, this it's, it's the size. How do you pick the size of a fireplace to go in the room? Um, some of it's uh, around the design, making sure it looks balanced in a room. You don't want something that's too small on a big ba uh, blank room. Um, but also, too, I mean, the majority of the reason, obviously, people get fireplaces is to heat a room. So you've got to make sure that it will suit the, the room size and heat it suitably. Well, because that one there looks impressive, doesn't it? Pretty I mean, cool. So yeah. It nice. is nice. Yeah. Very nice. Yeah. They've got all the dimensions right. You know, nice place to store your wood. The fireplace isn't overbearing in the in the in the um, you know area that it is. What is a fireplace usually made up of? And can you explain it in layman's terms? <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll do. Well, you've got uh, the the firebox or the fire engine, which is is the the unit that actually houses all the 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 fire itself as as such. Uh, the fuel bed for gas fireplaces is. The, the artificial log set that, that you see, uh, the fascia, which is essentially the trim around the outside of it, which can come in all sorts of different colours and tones and, and materials, and then the flue, which takes all the gases and stuff like that away, all the heat. Fluing wise, what sort of different types of fluing do we have? Uh, direct vent, uh, power flue, and, and also natural combustion. What's direct vent? Uh, direct vent is used in uh, the what it does is you have a cylinder inside a cylinder essentially, it pulls the cool air from the top down into the firebox and then that is used to then push the gases out the inner flue or the inner tube. Okay, let's talk about... <laughs> Lame <laughs> terms, yeah, 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 yeah. oh, <laughs> I was with you the whole way. Okay, let's talk about, I guess, efficiency and, and, and fireplaces, because I guess I'm thinking, you know, you've also got to have the fuel to fire it, and that, I guess, can sometimes, you know, uh, come into the equation of whether or not it's going to be efficient enough for you. But at the same time, you're producing some pretty good heat, aren't you? Oh, ab absolutely. I mean, technology is always a driver of efficiency in any appliance. Um, but yeah, I mean, certain uh, like wood fires compared to gas fires aren't quite as efficient and things like that. Well, so. What's your most popular at the moment? I guess there's a big trend towards gas fireplaces. Big trend towards gas fireplaces. Most homes today have gas for cooking and things like that. So it's an easy add-on for them to put into the house or the renovation if they're building. You know. And you don't have to keep going out to the woodshed to and get some wood, I quite like that. <laughs> <laughs> if you want that open flame look, though, you basically, you've got to have gas now, don't you? You do, particularly in suburbia, the wood, open wood fires are restricted to certain size sections and things like that, which just aren't practical in, in the likes of a city centre and things like that. The other thing that is uh, driving the efficiency side of things is trying to reuse the, the heat that is generated around the firebox. And that what they're doing now is using like a heat transfer system right? and taking that heat and then putting it into other rooms like bedrooms, down hallways and things like that. So that's quite, quite clever. Brilliant. Okay, now installation. Uh, what's that like? Um, the, <laughs> uh, that, 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 that's a, a curly one. Um, anything with installation, doesn't matter what it is, it's about planning, right. really. The, the more you plan ahead, the easier the installation will be. Um, new builds are relatively straightforward because you you know you got a lot more longer time frame. Renovations tend to be a lot obviously a shorter time frame and things like that. It's about what's up in the ceiling usually and right. how you get your flooring and things like that around it. But if people come and see your team, they can talk people through that. Yeah, yeah we can yeah. work through that with them, no problems. Nice work. Okay, and I do believe you've got a special promotion at the moment, which is what we like to hear when you come <laughs> on the cafe. Thank you. What have you got for us? We sure have. Uh, with a, we've got basically, buy any Renai product that we've got on promotion at the moment, and you go into the drawer, 
to win a, uh, one of three man caves or, or she sheds. Oh, man caves or she sheds. Yes, yes, nice. Indeed. I like it. Yeah, yeah, no, I very much do. And you know, you're right. It's the perfect time of year to be talking about this. I, I, I've always dreamed of having a fireplace. I've just got a heat pump at the moment. Uh, so thank you for displaying those options because I think it is a great idea. I'll come and see you if I need one. Absolutely. Nice one. work. Thank you. Thank you, Hamish. Thank you. Another great expert. For more details on any of the fireplaces we've talked about today, pop into one of Jeff's stores or you can go to his website, pex.co.nz.